Whew. Hey Joe. What? That equipment getting heavy yet? It hurt my back. <laughs> Joe and I are on another hunt for Ice Age fossils. We've brought out, well he's brought out a single scuba tank and I'm going to be free diving and fanning. And we're going to spend the whole day looking for some Ice Age Florida fossils. Whew. Joe's using the classic Florida ski poles to make sure you can get through these woods nice and easy. The wild Joe attempts to get through the end of the road. A blockage so high and great, no fossil hunter could ever get through it. Joe uses the butt method. As he swings one leg across, we hope his momentum doesn't carry him and topple him over. Beautifully done. Beautifully done. We've still got a decent ways to go, but we're close to the spot where we want to try to uncover thousands, if not millions of years of Florida's history. And I can already tell you, I am very happy to be out here looking around. Joe, you ready to find some fossils? Ready to go home. We haven't even got there yet. I want to go home. He's tired. All right, we are at today's honey hole, and I am going to jump in because I am on gator duty. Woo! I swear that's not an underwater spring. Joe just likes to really gulp down water. Really beautiful spot to be hunting today. Super thankful to be here. Let's get back underwater. Joe just gave me a poke and said, you gotta check this out. That is an awesome camelid tooth. Nice roots, really pretty blue and gray colors. It's definitely top shelf. Ice Age fossil right there. Yeah. Probably, what, 50 to 100,000 years? Probably, maybe a little bit older. Some of this stuff is really well cooked. That's, it ain't saying. It's nice. All right, get back in there. Put it up on the bank for me. Sure with my stuff, not with your junk. Hey, it's your first find, dude. <laughs> Get more stuff. Joe just popped back up, so I'm gonna show him this blue bottle I just found. Here you go. Cool. You're my bromo, and that's some, I think it says it over here, that's some bromo seltzer. Here you go, bro. You getting some bone? Yeah, a little chunks. There's some stuff in here. Yep. Joe, how long have you been fanning? Like 10 minutes. And how much air have you used? A third of an hour and a half. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I got big lungs. <laughs> Some. How's that doggy style working? Didn't work. Didn't work? 
Yeah, you gotta just hold on to a log down there and fan. You got your first piece of a mastodon tooth, though? Well, today. I grabbed the chunk, too. Oh. That's better than mine. Actually, you know what? I think it goes to mine. I'll take that. <laughs> oh, look at there. It does go to mine. Nice. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny if you You could did. make a case for it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we gotta find more, though. That's a really good sign that there's this big of chunks. Yeah, that means there might be a whole tooth that we could find today. That'd be really cool. Yeah, that'd be nice. Get back to work, boy. Put that on the bank for me. Say please. Now. <laughs> <laughs> So I just found this really cool fossilized rodent jaw and I've noticed that Joe has finished gulping down air and is trying to take a nap. Sleepy Joe over there. Sleepy Joe. Joe might still be napping but I'm managing to find a couple fossils. It's a really nice giant armadillo osteoderm. You want to see, buddy? So these would have been right underneath the skin, and they would have protected the giant armadillos from attack. And Joe's going to need some of these if he's just going to lay out in the middle of the wild and not get eaten by a bear. It's an awesome giant armadillo osteoderm. What is it? It's a damsel fly. Why is it on me? That's good luck. Is it gonna poop on me? I don't think so, but it's gonna go right in your mouth if it does. Do they poop? Mm. Do they poop? Uh, Joe, didn't you read the book? What book? The one we all poop. So it's gonna poop on me? Yup. Uh oh. Get it off. Uh oh, no, it's cute. I can't see it. There he is. Blue. There we go. The last find from today is a giant tortoise spur. From one of the giant tortoises that used to live here in Florida. We found some pretty awesome stuff. Even though we had a pretty busy day, we've got a small bone from either a turtle or a mammal. Joe, what do you think? Turtle? It's turtle. So we got a small turtle bone? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Pretty cool. We've got our giant armadillo osteoderm. One of the staples for out here fossil hunting. Really nice armored plate that would have been right underneath the skin. They would have had over a thousand of those bad boys, which is pretty cool. We've got an opossum or raccoon jaw with no teeth. A really cool rodent jaw with a really nice canine going all the way through it. Gator tooth and then our only section, well my only section, of mastodon tooth from today. Didn't get lucky. Joe got the nicest single tooth from the day. That is an awesome extinct camelid tooth from the lower jaw. Would have been the biggest tooth. And then his only piece of mastodon tooth. Yep. We did find, however, a lot of bone. It was going through a ton, but no teeth. And then we did find some ivory, but it's kind of a slow day. Oh, we also got a ton of bottles that we'll get out of here and recycle. But we had a fun time. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, share, subscribe, and you can see more of yeah, this ladies. wonderful human being. We got bottles. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh yeah. Oh, ew, gross. Ew. Ew, it's all over my chest. See you next time.